To maintain safety and hammer longevity, it is important to follow a daily and weekly inspection checklist. The first things to check during routine inspection are for loose or broken fasteners. Replace any broken fasteners and torque any loose or replaced fasteners. Refer to the hammer fastener torque charts for torque specifications. The torque charts can be found in the hammer service manual. The hammer bracket needs to be inspected for fatigue cracks or cracked welds. If cracks are found, refer to the hammer service manual for repair procedures or contact NPK for assistance. Inspect the hydraulic hoses and tubing for leaks, loose clamps, and hose abrasion. Repair as needed. Regularly inspect the hammer for hydraulic oil leaks. If there is oil leaking down the tool or from the weep hole on the side of the hammer main body, this indicates the hammer's seals are worn or damaged and the hammer must be resealed. Oil leaking from a hose swivel or between the main valve and hammer body indicates worn or damaged O-rings. The solution is to replace the leaking O-rings. Tool to bushing clearance must be monitored for hammer longevity. Refer to the service manual for maximum tool to bushing clearance. If the clearance is at maximum, remove the tool and measure the tool diameter and the inside diameter of the lower tool bushing. Tool and bushing wear specifications can be found in the hammer service manual. To reduce the tool to bushing clearance, it may require changing either the tool, the lower bushing, or both. It is also important to inspect the retaining pin and tool retaining pin slot. Use a flat blade screwdriver and a pair of channel lock pliers to remove the retaining pin ring. Thread a lifting eye bolt into the retaining pin and remove the pin. Inspect the pin for wear. Then dress worn areas using a grinder. Using a lifting sling, remove the tool and inspect the retaining pin slot for wear. Grind contact area as required. If the tool is dull, it can be sharpened using a surface grinder or milling machine using sufficient machining coolant. Do not sharpen the tool with a cutting torch. Hammer longevity is also controlled by maintaining a clean hydraulic system. Conduct periodic oil sampling and change oil and filters as recommended by carrier specifications. Hammer, tool, and tool bushing longevity is achieved by greasing the hammer and by avoiding binding the tool into the bushing. If the hammer does not have an auto lube system, it should be greased once per hour. Refer to the service manual for greasing procedure, correct grease, and greasing intervals. Thank you for tuning into this video about routine inspections. Please check out one of our other service instructionals.